What's up guys? Welcome to our Father's Day live stream. Now, we have got some cool knives. Graham, how are you? Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right guys, so what we have today, we have Ooh. got some Father's Day sale knives that we're gonna go over real quick. And then towards the end, we also have just some good gift ideas for dad. Now, I am excited to jump in and I know Graham is too. Yeah, I'm super Are excited you? guys. I, I like Father's Day, you know, I don't, I don't have any kids to give me Father's Day presents, but I've always liked Father's Day. It's a lot of good memories growing up as a kid. And honestly, a lot of these gift ideas I should have thought about growing up to give my dad because there's a lot of awesome uh, choices to go from on sale and just really cool knives that to give. I think I'm pretty sure that when I was a child there was one Father's Day I remember being really little but I gathered up like 10 of my favorite rocks from the yard <laughs> and I was getting rocks. So it yeah, works. Knives might yeah, be better. Knives are probably going to be better than rocks. Okay uh, should we just jump in? Yeah let's see what you got man. Okay all right guys starting off we have got Gerber Automatics. All the Gerber automatics are on sale. Uh, this one right here is the Mini Covert. Uh, it is $104.99. It's cool one with the S30V, the deep carry pocket clip, and the safety lock. Yeah, and I like the little snappy action on that guy. Yeah. It's pretty cool. They have a full size one as well, right. which is also on sale. If you're looking for a guy with maybe more Hammier hands? Hammier? Yeah, hammier hands. I don't know why they gave me the small one. Mm -hmm. Don't you have another auto over there as well? I do, I do. I yeah, have yeah. the 06 auto, and it is on sale. All the Gerber autos are on sale. Like yeah. I said, this one right here is $140 on the website. Also, you get the S30V Steel and that beefy 06 profile. Yeah, it's well, a, and the 06 auto, it's a standard. It's a standard auto. You know, really it's a... Uh, it's been out for a long, long time, and it's a hot seller, so it's kind of interesting to actually see it go on sale. Safety. 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 Safety first. Safety first. All right, guys. Uh, did, I, did I say the price? 140 you did, but let's on tell, the let's tell the guys again. All right, 140 on the website. 140 on the website. All right, well, we're going to hop over from some Gerbers to some other Gerbers. The Gerber Strongarm fixed blade is also on sale comes with the uh the the sheath locker thingy here with all sorts of things that you can attach with it, it guys it's actually really cool there there's like four different types of attachments inside the box mm -hmm. and you can pretty much strap it to yeah. anything yeah no it's it's super awesome and uh i think this you can actually put it in and out ambi yeah I like Just that. making sure. I was pretty sure it was, but I had to actually do it for myself. Um, but yeah, you know, you guys know what it is. Uh, on sale. What? Wait, what's the price on this? Now, there's there's a question here. So what's the price? So here's the thing. Is we are not allowed to tell you what the price is because apparently the price is too low. It seems like, yeah, I know what you're thinking, but... We can't put the price, or we can't say the price here, and we can't print it, put it on the website unless you add it to your cart. So, a couple of extra steps for you before you can see how cheap this thing is or inexpensive this thing is. Um, but I tell you, it's well worth it. Go on the site, check it out. Um, I can't say any more without the lawyers getting mad at me. So, go Heck over the yeah. header to check it out. Honestly, I, I really love that as a fixed blade. Oh, yeah. Um, crazy good options. Add it to cart. You guys will not want to miss out on that price. Oh, I have another one. Oh, you should have another one. Oh, hey, also, if you spend a hundred and nineteen, not hundred and nineteen, hundred and nineteen, they're very specific about that. Over a hundred and nineteen dollars, we throw this in the shopping cart with you. We throw it in. Yeah, it's for free. So maybe you uh, buy yourself a knife and you give your dad a T-shirt. Yeah, Father's I mean that O six Auto I think was over one nineteen. Yep. Right. Yep. 06 Oz 119, free t-shirt right then and there. So whether you get a knife and a t-shirt or maybe he just gets a t-shirt out of your own out of your own shopping, it's a great way to go about it. I am terrible at folding miscellaneous t-shirts, but yeah, miscellaneous t-shirts. You know, whatever. Yeah, sure. Okay. I've my turn, right? You're, you're you're back up. All right, guys, I got a Civivi Elementum. You guys know what it is. It's got the D2 steel, the blue G10 handles, and a 
deep carry pocket clip. Frame lock, or liner lock. Liner I don't know lock, what I was... Yeah. I don't know what that was. You were trying to think about all the rocks you're going to give your dad again this rocks, year. Rocks, yeah. locks, socks. Yeah. In a box. Well, where else would you put it? <laughs> all right, guys. D2 Steel, $45 on the website. It's $44.25. I'm just going to round up. It's $45 on the website, guys. Go out. Check them out. We have other Civiti Elementums on sale as well. A bunch of different colors. So, there you go. Yeah. I mean, obviously, CVV Elementum is probably a knife that a lot of people have in their uh, collection already. But, you know, adding that to, to your dad's collection, I think, would be a good move. I would almost say, actually, I'm going to say it, it is one of the best functional, centered, action, D2 steel mm -hmm. knives out there where you get everything that you want all in one, under 50 bucks. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's, an amaz it's amazing how how much the Elementum has kind of taken the EDC market by storm. Oh, yeah. Um, but, I mean, once you hold it, you see why. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Yeah. What you got? I have the Blade HQ Exclusive Kershaw Leak with copper scales and CPM 154 blade steel. This is actually, this this knife is actually pretty close to my heart. This uh, This is probably one of the first, like, Knife knives, you know, the ones that I didn't find in the gas station that I owned and is in the original leak, like almost shoot, like two decades ago. I, I actually yeah. had the same thing. I had really? a green one, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I probably wasn't old enough to take care of that tip as well as I should have. <laughs> you know, I maybe use it as a pry bar a little too much, but uh, awesome knife, and it's just really cool to see a more premium version like this. And not, not to mention that it's on sale as well. Um, this thing, Eighty-four ninety-nine, and considering the higher end scales and the CPM one fifty-four, which is a great steel, uh, it's it's an awesome deal. Um, liner lock, and you know, I even skipped over the biggest part is this is one of the first, what they call it, speed safe. Yep, speed, the speed safe. safe assist open knives from uh, Ken Onion that he that he developed. Love it. I absolutely love this knife, and I'll never never stop loving it because of. Uh, because it's just a good knife. Oh, Ken. Oh, Always Ken. coming out with bangers. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> awesome on the site. Go scoop it up. Oh, okay. Oh, man. I'm a, I'm a sheet behind. I have got... Oh, man. Actually, my next two are Burnley designs. Oh, really? So, Lucas. What's up, man? I miss you, guy. All right, guys. I got the Burnley Sketch by CRKT. This is in a Desert Warrior uh, color pattern that's got D2 steel. Uh, it has a deep carry pocket clip that is actually recessed smooth, flat underneath. It kind of will still have the little ducktail stick out of your pocket, yeah. but it is a cool... I, I just love a deep carry pocket clip oh, yeah. that's, that's has the screws all got sunk tucked underneath. In there. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it makes it nice. It's a frame lock. It's got the G10 scales, like I said. And it is going for $35 on the website. Does that have like a little copper washer around the pivot there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got the little accent, the yeah. pivot collar, and the backspacer and collar over here. It's a frame and, lock, too. Wow. Yeah, frame Jeez. lock, dude. I don't know. You probably said that already. I just wasn't paying Heck attention. Heck yeah. Plus, it's Lucas Burnley, you guys. Yeah, for How sure. do you not want to buy Lucas's designs? You don't. 30, you, you, you don't not buy. 35 That's like what? Three, four trips to Taco Bell. Depends on who we're, who we're talking about here. But I guess that's true. Let's go run over here to another really solid EDC designer's knife. It is the Kaiser Feist, Justin Lundquist design. Um, we actually have three of these models on the website. Uh, or I should say flavors, flavors of this flavors. model. Uh, on the website, um, they range from $49.99 for the G10 orange version. Uh, all the way up to ninety nine ninety nine, which is still a steal of a deal. I think MSRP on these things are like two hundred forty bucks. But yeah, it's um, the steel on this guy is S thirty five VN. We got that kind of forged, shredded carbon fiber uh, scales on it. Got some nice machined backspacers on here as well, and then a machined uh, pocket clip liner lock. Honestly, it's it's Feist Friday too. Of course, we got to talk about this Heck one. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, on the site, 
this one's $99.99, all the way down to $49.99 for G10 version. It's If your dad's a little more refined, uh, I think, and needs kind of that the little, the the popular EDC knife, because he kind of keeps up with the trends, this is one that he should be owning for sure. But yeah. Plus, it's one of my favorite front flippers, guys. So fun, so easy. Oh, This is probably what I've spent most time at Blade HQ trying to perfect. Is because you the there's a little there's a little bit of a trick to getting that front flipper to front flip, especially with our hands. Dude, I think if I tried right now on the spot, I'd probably fail. I'm not gonna do it. Uh, okay. Okay, you gotta do it. You gotta do it. That was slow. It was soft. Ooh. Index finger. Nice man. I I'm definitely not that expert yet. But yeah, what you got? Okay, I have, now this is my last item that I'm talking about for sale items on my side, mm -hmm. and it is the Lucas Burnley Keyhone Desert Warrior made by Boker. Now, Lucas, <laughs> if only I could have a glimpse into your mind and the thought behind these designs. Honestly, does, does everybody else need to leave the room for a second? It's... Go ahead. Go he pro ahead. He's probably won't even see this video. No, he won't. Well, so it's a love letter. <laughs> it's a love letter. It's a love letter to Lucas. And I'm going to end it right here. Beep. <laughs> All right, guys. The Boker Keyhone in Desert Warrior style colorways. Uh, I actually really like this knife design. Uh, it fits well in the hands. You got just the right amount of jimping on a tiny little thumb ramp. It's actually, I don't even know if I'd call it a thumb ramp. It just kind of comes out and cuts back in. You call it a thumber. 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 Thumb ran. Just falls right off. Yeah, absolutely. I love the deep carry wire clip. That is always cool. I love wire clips. I think that a lot of people, I, they may have a misconception that, oh, it's just wire. Like it might be, yeah, might not be strong enough. You know what I mean? But actually the wire clips are very strong. I really like them because they are minimal and they don't yeah, show. And it keeps the weight down too. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So D2 steel aluminum handles, and this is thirty-seven ninety-nine dollars on the website. You, you can't really beat that, man. I love the keyhone. Yeah. Plus that action. Snappy, man. Snappy. Woo. Woo wee. Well, those are some fun sale knives, man. Yes, they are. Um, well, we're gonna move into I think a couple of uh, knives that I think are gonna be good gift ideas, regardless. Um, I'll start off here. Blade HQ takedown mat. Uh, we've actually had these for I don't know, like six months, eight months now. Yeah, yeah. And these have been extremely popular. Uh, you know, tearing down knives, putting them back together, lubing, lubing them. Uh, any sort of maintenance you need to do, this thing's gonna be with you for a while. Easy to clean off, and you got all these textures on the mat itself here, uh, so it kind of prevents a lot of those screws from running away from you as you're taking stuff apart. Uh, really good, and they're all kind of biased toward the center to, to drive the, the screws back towards the middle. Uh, really, really good gift idea for almost all dads. Whether or not they have knives or not, they can, you can probably make sushi. <laughs> With it, too. Oh, secondary use, the sushi folder. Yeah, roller. it's not food safe. I, can't, I cannot confirm that. Uh, but we got a bunch of these on the website. We've got, uh, like, a desert tan one, a... Um, black. Black. Uh, so many I can't even remember. Glow in the dark. We, gl we do have a glow in the dark one. Now these go for nineteen ninety five. Now the glow in the dark version, you pay a little extra for that glow in the dark flare. Um, but uh, the glow in the dark one goes for twenty three ninety five. Do you want to know why we made the glow in the dark one? This is exactly the reason why. Tactical reasons? No, because we want you guys to shine a light on it and then shut the lights off and undo your scales and and swap out your scales on your miscellaneous knives. I didn't read that anyway. I didn't either. I just, you know. Well, are you just trying to start something? Well, maybe. Well, why don't we start on your next knife for uh, good gift ideas. <laughs> All right, guys. Good gift ideas. I have got the Victorinox Super Tinker in the Lobo Loco pattern here. Crazy Wolf. Crazy Wolf, designed by our guy here, Seishuan Sean. Um, he always comes out with cool I ideas. I didn't know he designed that one. Yeah. He's a, that's, that's pretty cool. We call him Schwan, say yeah. Schwan. Sean. 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 It's Sean. Sean's Sean. a stud. He's always coming out with cool uh, design ideas. 
I love it when we get to translate it into a knife scale, especially something like the Super Tinker, which I think, not because of me, but I've, I've seen more and more people starting to carry a thicker Victorinox in their pocket in addition to whatever else they have. Of course. You know. Of course. I mean, it's a standard. Right. All right, guys. Super Tinker. It's got all sorts of stuff. What's the tool count on it? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. 14 functions. 14. Oh, does this one have... Tweezers? Oh, I couldn't see it because it's like kind of gray down there. Yeah, tweezers, man. I mean, that's that's the main reason for owning <laughs> uh, any Vitronoxes. It's uh, it's because having those tweezers will save you from so many splinters that you, who's who, where else are you gonna carry tweezers in your pocket? I don't know. Yeah, I actually used the tweezers out of mine the other day. I had a slivar. A slivar. A slivar. What else you got? Oh. Thirty-two ninety-five on the website for the Lobo Loco. Awesome gift idea. I love Heck it. Heck yeah. Okay, so I was thinking about this. And what's the most dad gift idea that's knife centric? Uh I'll just tell you. Okay. So <laughs> what came to mind is the Buck 110. I mean, is there is there a more dad knife? than a buck 110 in your opinion? You know what, it kind of falls into that nostalgia era of knives from the past that our dads had back in the day, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So the buck 110 is a cool option because they're constantly just tweaking mm -hmm. it and it's just, it's been a solid yeah. series throughout uh, and the this beginning one, of time. And this one in particular, it's a pretty cool one. This one got S, has S30V steel. Um, it has the, I'll butcher the name, it's either Boss or Boz heat treat mm. on this blade as well. And uh, I got educated actually out in Blade Show a little bit more about uh, the Boss heat treat system. Um, and apparently it just kind of ramps up the performance of almost any steel you you or that you treat, any steel that you treat. Um, with heat. With heat, <laughs> any steel <laughs> that you treat with, with heat just to another level. So at S30V, obviously it's gonna be a back lock, awesome little knife, your dad will love it. Um, this guy, the premium version, is going to go for $99.99 on the website. And he can go straight to cutting his apples up with his buck knife. Buck knife. And buck that's, a, that's, knife. What, that's what they do with it, right? Yeah. Cut, uh, cut apples that's with it. That's all they do. Delve out advice. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> all right, guys. I have something that is not a knife. Now, this is the Phoenix E30R. Oh, there we go. So this is a really bright flashlight. It has, I think, four or five different modes. Five different modes. And the cool part about it is it's got this little uh, magnet rechargeable plate yeah. that the charging cap just goes. Yeah, and honestly, I'm a huge fan of, of that system as they become more prevalent instead of having to pop out those essentially those like camera flash batteries, right? Which burn out on you, and a lot of them don't recharge this like as well. But that uh, the mag tsk, yeah. charger connection, it's really good to see it popping up in the uh, in the flashlight industry. Well, and what I love about it is because I get home and when I empty my pockets, it's phone, watch. Whatever I I plug all my stuff mm -hmm. in my knife. I don't plug, plug my your knife, knife in. in. <laughs> Extra charge. Extra charge. Keep it sharp by yeah. plugging it in. Yes, at night. absolutely. Uh, USB C straight into the bug out. Done. <laughs> Done. <laughs> no, but it's cool because you can actually set this. You lay it down. You have all your stuff right there. At least I like to keep my stuff organized like sure. that. Sure. Sure. So it's a really cool one. Sixteen hundred lumens. That is ten thousand candela. And it's got this really cool pocket clip, deep yeah. carry. Sit, sits down in the yeah. bouquet. The bouquet. That's awesome. What's the price on it? Uh, seventy nine ninety nine. Uh, I messed with that a little bit before we were setting up, and I don't know how I do it. Every time I pick up small pocket or uh, small flashlights like that, um, the I always find the strobe mode first thing. <laughs> yeah, just blind. Like I'm, I still have still have spots from it, but I always find the the strobe mode before any. Other modes. Not the strobe mode. Strobe mode. Strobe mode. All right, well, I have one last thing here. Kind of leaning in with the uh, Buck 110, 
the Leatherman Bond. Now, they did a little bit of a throwback to their original design that they had, uh, that Leatherman had come out with. And this was released, like, I think three months ago, two months ago, yeah. something like that. And I swear, it's uh, there's a couple little, like, changes with it, but... It's almost like a resto mod. Yeah, yeah. You like, know. it's... Uh, it's it, it reminds me exactly of the leather that my dad used to carry. You know, yeah. it's got the uh, kind of basic tools in here, uh, like you'd expect. What is the tool count on this thing? 14 and 1. I love it. Yeah. yeah. A tool for every day for two weeks. Yeah. 14 and 1. <laughs> hey, that would be a good challenge. Only one tool per day. Mm hmm. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. It, it, you're, that... you're trying to open up your. Sandwich. Sandwich? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what you're trying to hope. You're trying to hope something. You have the saw one day. <laughs> you got to open up the sandwich. Oh, and today's Phillips Day. I don't know how that's going to work out. Uh, but yeah, super awesome. Pretty self-explanatory. Uh, this on the website, $49.95. So nice little, for the for a Leatherman, it's a pretty good little price point. And I don't know, you might uh, you, you might have broken his old one. Uh, obviously, comes with a little carrying case that you throw on your hip to look even more dad. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Okay, guys. So that is what we have for the video today. Definitely check out the website. Go through all the different categories, gear, and all that other. And, and hook your dad up with some EDC stuff and some cool knives. And just one last reminder. Spend over $119 very specifically. <laughs> and we will throw one of these shirts, whatever size you need in the package. Sweet. Well, thanks Nailed for hanging it. out, guys. Heck yeah. We'll see you guys later.